So over here you can see that I am in the cut mode and if I were to go around and select out a clip right here, hold shift and use the uh, period key right here or the full stop key, then you can see that it nuzzes uh, in a certain length than what I uh, then have, uh, let's say for example, just pressing the comma and the uh, period key right here. Once you hold shift and press the comma and the period key, you can see that it moves uh, certain frames further away. So what you can also do is you can go around and then change out how the NAS, uh, uh, how, how much the uh, NAS happens when you press out the shift key. So to do that, you need to go around onto the DaVinci Resolve uh, menu right here, and then you need to go to preferences. And over here in preferences, you can go around over here onto uh, the editing settings. So I'm just going to go to user first, and then in user, you need to go to editing right here. And then over here under general settings right here, you can see the NAS length which is 5 frames right now. So whenever you hold shift and then you press the uh, period or the comma key, then it moves 5, 5 frames right here. So let's say I want this to move 25 frames so I can just go around and type that in and press save right here. And once you do that, you can go around, select out a clip and hold the shift button and then use the dot, dot button or the um, uh, period key right here. And you can see that it moves uh, 25 frames altogether. So you know, when, when, if you were to just press the dot right here, it still moves one frame. But if you were to hold shift, then what happens is that you can see the icon change right here and you can press the dot or the comma key right here. And then what happens is that it moves 25 frames just like that. And that is how you can go around and change the NAS clips preferences right there. You can also go around over here on to uh, the trim menu and here you can find the NAS option. So you can go around and let's say for example move one frame to the right right here or you can go around onto trim and then go to NAS and move let's say multi frame onto the right and that still moves 25 frames uh, just like that. So that is how you can uh, work around with the NAS clip preferences inside of DaVinci Resolve. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.